Hey everybody, this is Soda W Fan here, and I'm gonna do a review on episode 16 of Power Rangers Megaforce: The Human Factor. And first of all, let's say thank you for watching my previous reviews, for all the the likes and all the views on that, and uh, thank you for subscribing to my channel. Thank you for 365 subscribers. I hope I can continue to entertain you. Um. Okay, so the episode started with Rax. He's done. He's done with the insectoids. He's done. He's he's done. He created an underwater underwater lair. So he could create a new breed of villains which are robots. So he's done with the insectoids. They keep on failing and failing and failing. So I don't know if if, if this is the end for the insectoids or we're going to see them battle it out with Vax or they're going to cooperate and, and make a big team. I don't know what's going on. But Vax is done for right now. So it comes to the intro. Then when the intro is done... We see the Rangers take a little break, enjoy life, and we see Jake, Noah, and Troy playing soccer. So we didn't know they could play soccer. Um, yeah, they play soccer. We saw M and G hang out over the bridge, and wow, it's just like wow how Mega Forces. Just getting closer and closer to the end of the of the series. Uh, man, it's it's. I'm wondering. I'm wondering what's the end episode gonna be. What do you think? What do you think? How is it gonna be? Are we gonna see some cameos or are we gonna see them in Super Mega Force? Let me know. But I'm I'm anxious to see what's gonna happen. How this is gonna turn out. So we see. We see. Emma looking at the over the bridge and she was thinking about how the world was before. Now she she, she got into really deep thought. And then Gia she went to get some ice cream and she while they were talking, before she got the ice cream, they was talking about how the Rangers are like family. They really grown to become family. And and they, they like, they want to stay being rangers. They want to stay protecting the world. So then Gia gets some ice cream. And you know that Emma and Gia are best friends. So she hooked her up with some ice cream. Also, her favorite kind, she, she knows. And the rangers, well, they, they're just relaxing the day. Then, um... Jake and Jake offered to put take some pictures of them. So took some pictures. The Rangers had to go on duty. So right when Jake fell in the trash can. Right when he fell into the trash can. It was it was hilarious. It was hilarious. He he he, he was taking pictures in the back and walking back and then he fell in the trash can. It was it was classic, you gotta see it. It was classic Power Rangers uh, comedy. You got to see it. So, the Rangers fight this new this new villain, which is a robot. And they fight him off. But it seemed, he seems to be too much. He uses this junk. Because they were fighting in an abandoned warehouse. He, he took this junk and made it into a shield. So... He uses it to block all the ranger's shots. And it appears to be too much. So. They. they try to fight him off. They try to. With ultra mode. Not enough. Robo Knight comes in. He hesitates to attack. Because he knows. That's his robot ally. Kind of. It's like, it's like a robot to robot thing. And he 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 he's hesitating to fight. Now, 
the Rangers trying to convince him that he's evil. But Rogue Knight, Rogue Knight, he he just he's just too his mind is too in a robot thing. So he gets shot. He in it in. We never seen Robo Knight get taken down like this. It was like boosh, crashed into uh, burn burnt cars and all this junk. He's out. The Rangers have to fight him off, but then the villain who locks him up in chains, locks him up in chains. Then Jake, I mean Troy. Troy gets knocked in to these big burials, and he's trying to contact Robo Knight, see if he's okay. He he still has a little life in him to see if Robo Knight's okay. Robo Knight says he's fine. He's just trying to reload, and then Troy all of a sudden leaps into action, takes out the 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 villain, and Jake and Gia are released themselves from the chains with their snake axe. And Tiger Claw, and they start fighting them off, and then they they use their Ultra Zords to destroy the villain for the moment. Robo Knight, he's still he's still wondering like what's going on. So we see Vrak trying to upgrade him. Now he's got this robot sidekick. That's a female robot. A female robot as is as like a second right hand girl, so so to speak. And she's she she's always upgrading robots, which is shown in this. She's upgrading the robot that they are fighting that they were fighting previously and made it stronger and and more indestructible. And then the Rangers in another scene, there was talking about the robots are more difficult to fight than the monsters. So they they're like distraught, and the robot knight is also distraught about his about his robot, um, his ro his robot kind of kind of relatives, so to speak. But isn't he's he's not related to him at all. But he's he, he's it's like a robot thing to him. So they go to Ernie's. They, Emma and Gia, they finish their ice cream early. Then the guys, they get their ice cream. And, you know, as a ranger, you when you're always relaxing, it's always something popping up. Jake was about to eat his ice cream. The rangers, the rangers' alarm went off in the, on their morphers. They had to go. And Jake was angry. Every time he buys ice cream from Ernie's, boom, that money just... Goes right down the drain, and he has to go fight. Ernie's making a lot of money. <laughs> Ernie's making a lot of money, he, but because the Rangers, they they always buy food, and they always end up leaving it. But he Ernie's rich. Ernie's rich. <laughs> so they go fight the upgraded robot, and the upgraded robot too much for him. As usual, when when you see the robots get upgraded to a better, better, a better body, so they, they, they they're too much for him. He's too much for him. You actually see the villain, just the the um, Rex wing, like I don't know what to call her. It's like, is she with them? Are they both together, or she's just on the side? I can't tell, but she's there. She walk. She 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 talks to Robo and I trying to convince him to join the the, the group led by Vrak, the, the robotic group. And he's he's like thinking. She she's trying to convince him by telling the Rangers on the bad side, on the bad side. So it's like he's torn. Like what is he gonna do? And then the Rangers, Rangers, they they're like trying to say Robo Knight, Robo Knight. Come on, man. We are the good guys. They're the bad guys. They're trying to trick you. So, the, the villain's going to retreat for the moment. And Robo Knight, he's got to take a breather and consume all this. And process all this all this stuff that's going on. So, the ranger's like, dude. And so, they got to go. 
and fight to fight to fight the villain. They gotta fight him off. They go into ultra mode. They right when they was about to launch their plan. They and they this space they, they said this the space was perfect for our plan. I don't know. I don't know if this plan is for next episode or I don't know. I don't know. It, it, but I'm just gonna tell you, it never happened. It never happened. So the Rangers fight him off, but it's just a little bit, just a little bit, and but and the and the bots are just too much for him. You actually see the the robotic the robotic girl fighting fighting the Rangers, you know, Huzzah and all that stuff, <laughs> all that all that stuff when 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 the villains are pretty tight, they always ruin it with that. So. But anyway, they always they're fighting off the Rangers. They're too much. They they hit them so hard that they go out of ultra mode. They go out of ultra mode. Robot comes in just in the nick of time, and he says, "Guys, I'm with the Rangers." So the 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 Rangers they get back up, and the the villains are shocked. They are really really shocked. So the Rangers go into ultra mode. And they 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 charge in ultra dynamic and also Robo Knight with night dynamic. They they the ultra rangers they stick their 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 little swords out and they put them together and then Robo Knight's night dynamic weapon goes on top. It, it's not combined. It's just like sticking out in like a shape. It's not like combined weapons, but it's it's like the fire goes the same way. It goes together. When it's shot, so it takes out the villain, launches him out, but the the robotic the robotic woman or girl she she got out just in the nick of time and she retreated and she said I'll be back. This this isn't over, and then when then Vrak sends out his zombats and he makes the robot grow, and the Rangers they gotta go do what they do best and get in the Megazord, but it's not. The regular Megazord that you've been seeing from the first episode. No, no, no. They're using the Ultra Command Center. And they they get in there. Robo Knight uses his Knight Brothers Megazords to make his Knight Megazord. And then they, they just fight him off. They just fight him off. Robo Knight punching, using his um, kicks with by launching his foot, his like foot out to him. And have him ricocheting, and then you you see the Ultra Command Center Zord actually his chest actually opens and just fires, 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 fires. It's it's amazing, and they end it off with 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 the with the victory charge, and he's done. So Vrak is a little disappointed, but he knows what he's got to do to to defeat the Rangers. So this is not the end. He's not having second thoughts. He's Still certain that robots are better than monsters, and he's gonna make sure that the monsters destroy the Rangers at the end of the day. But this is the end of the episode for right now. And the Rangers, they go see Robo Knight, and they they thank him for what he's doing, for, for what he did, and helping him out, staying with the team. And he cracked a joke. He cracked it. He cracked his first joke. Well, not his first joke. Not since some last laugh, but he cracked another joke, and Jake was surprised. And and Emma got got a little got not emotional, but she she got really deep into that thought about the about the, um the past, about the past and the future and how their the Rangers are more important, just as important as the trees and the animals on the planet. So they. Feel like they need to step up their game and really, really stay, stay on top of it and save the world. So I give this episode a five, a five out of five. Yeah, it was a pretty good episode. It, we really got to see uh, the new, different, some new villains with some with a, with a backstory, and we got to see the Rangers really get in to in touch with. With their with their with their abilities, they really they really understand what they gotta do now. So we got to see Robo Knight too. Get 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 in the feel of working with the Rangers. So by the time Endgame comes, the final episode, 
I think that the Rangers will be better than they are now. I think they'll be better than ever. I think they'll they'll, they'll know what they got to do, and they will be able to take out the villains with the help of the Retro Rangers. They'll be right up there by the end of the episode. I believe it. They'll be right up there with the Retro Rangers. So, what did you think of the episode? Did you see it? Did you not see it? You should see it. Did you like it? Did you dislike it? Do you do you think Mega Force is cheesy? Do you do you dislike it? Do you do you do you like it? Do you, are you looking forward to the end of episode, the end game? And hey, just let me know all that good stuff in the comment section below. If you click like, don't leave the page until you comment right here and subscribe. And all the people that's watching this video, thank you. I really, I really thank you for watching my videos. I really thank you. And I am going to continue doing reviews. Hopefully, hopefully I get better and better and better with my videos. And soon, hopefully I'm getting a TV show or something. I don't know. But thank you for watching my videos. And I really appreciate it. All my subscribers, all my viewers. Really, you matter. And, yeah, see you later.